Prisons in Texas are the hottest anywhere in America. It's simply because they're not legally required to have air conditioning, which means it's not uncommon for jail cell temperatures to exceed 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Former inmate Eugene Blackman experienced two weeks when the heat index hit above 130 degrees. Oh man, it was like uh, an oven, living in an oven. There's no ventilation. Water condition as to drinking water. There's no drinking fountains. You got to drink out the sinks. In extreme heat, 14 inmates died. Their deaths led the University of Texas to investigate the overheating problem. They discovered evidence of the heat index at one prison topping 150. The temperatures that, that are present in uh, Texas prisons are very, very dangerous to the health of any human being. Report author Ariel Dulutsky was astounded that Texas, unlike other neighboring states, does not have standards or laws to control the temperature. People are dying from something that it could be prevented. Why we, we, we don't have is because it is a, a forgotten population, because it doesn't appear that there is a, a political will from the authorities to adopt the, those regulations. It doesn't appear that there's, there is an interest to protect the, the rights of these inmates. The report found that 150,000 inmates in around 100 prison units are being forced to live without climate control. This is a typical cell for Texas's inmates. It's nine feet long, six feet wide. Some of the older cells are even smaller than this. It's a small cramped space for two people. And of course, there's no air conditioning. Prison guards also endure the same conditions. Union representative Lance Lowry says he's seen more than 150 officers leave in the last two years, many suffering heat stroke or heart conditions. It feels like a convection oven when you're in the prisons. Uh, the sun hits these buildings all day long, heats the buildings up, traps the heat inside and the ventilation is uh, extremely poor. You have a, a state that has, has uh, cut its budgets down so far that uh, basic necessities are not being uh, met. Lowry says it's time for Texas to play catch up with the rest of the world. I would like to see the state of Texas step into the 21st century and uh, add climate control to their prisons. You're not going to find any public facilities or buildings built in the last 30 years that are not equipped with uh, air conditioning and climate control, with the exception of our prisons here in Texas. Lawsuits have been filed against the Texas Department of Criminal Justice, but it maintains air conditioning is too expensive to add. For now, campaigners can only continue their fight against what they say is unconstitutional and try to force Texas to change its ways. Nick Harper for Telesaur, Austin, Texas.